I'm John Florida, Vice President for Government and Relations of the American Chiropractic Association, here with our good friend and colleague, hey, Rick John, Miller. Hey, John, good to be with you this morning. Rick, uh, I understand uh, uh, several weeks ago you um, you picked up uh, some uh, additional duties here at uh, ACA. Let's well, well, tell the viewers a little bit about that. Well, my portfolio's expanded a little bit, at least for the time being. Uh, but, you know, that's not slowing us down in our advocacy campaign. Uh, and we are moving full speed ahead with a very aggressive uh, program here coming up shortly here in Washington where we're going to be featuring uh, and promoting any number of important issues to the profession. John, why don't you tell them about NCLC and what you've got planned? Well, yeah, starting uh, just about uh, two weeks uh, from now, uh, we'll have our annual uh, leadership conference is what it's being called now. It still has the same initials, NCLC. We, we changed the uh, uh, legislative part to leadership part because we've we've melded in so many more right. components in, into it's this a broader venue. program. It's right a broader pro program, a lot of education, and but we've kept kept the legislative component part of it because it's very important. It's our one day of the year when we get hundreds of students right. and doctors here in Washington that they can go up and advocate on the Hill for us. Now we've got uh, three bills in the hopper mm -hmm. right now. Uh, that we'll be um, advocating for once uh, once they come here. All specific, for, all specific, all specific related chiropractic. All specific to chiropractic. We have two uh, issues that are, are should be familiar to folks, and that is to uh, further integrate doctors of chiropractic in the VA, and also uh, expand benefits for dependents and retirees who access the military health care system, known as Tricare. We've been working on those bills for several years, many of our viewers may know, but it takes persistence in order to get these across the finish line. One new thing that we're working on this year is to include doctors of chiropractic in the National Health Service Corps. Now, the National Health Service Corps yep. is a program run by the federal government where if you serve in a medically underserved area in a community health center, you get a good portion of your student loans paid for. Very important. Currently, we're not eligible for that program. As you remember, right. we had a um, demonstration project, oh gosh, more than 10 years ago, um, and those had mixed results. But we believe, and members of Congress should believe this too, that we belong in that program along with other providers. Well, the time is right. And these pieces of legislation are not only important and beneficial because uh, they, would, they would impact doctors of chiropractic in a positive way, and more importantly, the patients we serve. But it, again, when you look at the entire profession, these things help confer a great deal of cultural authority right. uh, onto the profession. Mm -hmm. So these are very important initiatives, and, and we need everyone's support for them. And for those folks who can't come to NCLC, there's plenty of information mm -hmm. up on our website about this legislation. John will talk about that in a minute. Yeah, just uh, to uh, further what you started, uh, last year we started with a, uh, an email campaign before NCLC uh, so folks can uh, contact their legislators if they're not coming and urge them to support and co-sponsor these bills. We're going to be doing that again. You'll see those alerts starting next week. They'll be on an every other day basis, you'll see them, you'll see them, there'll be three in all. You see these, take a few minutes. All it takes is a few mouse clicks. Contact your member of Congress, very important, because as we know, it's a numbers game. That's right. It's, it's very, we gotta build the numbers, both in co-sponsors and both our, our folks contacting these members of Congress. Well, we're competing for attention with all sorts of other interest groups out there and associations and corporations and you name it. So again, getting on the radar mm -hmm. screen, helping to move our issues onto the front burner is very important. Now, I think, John, if I'm not mistaken, this is our last video prior to the event. But we'll be doing one at NCLC, right. so watch for that. Watch and, for that, too. Yeah. yeah. And there's still time. There's still right. time to register and to come to Washington. If you're in a local area, we'd love to have you. Just go to our website, www.acatoday.org slash NCLC. All the information is up there for you, and you can uh, register, come to Washington. We need your help. We look forward to seeing you at NCLC. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, John.